Hey guys, Sparky here. Today I'm going to show you how I terminate a commercial electrical panel. That first thing you want to do is make sure you have a nylon bushing on each of these pipes. As you're putting your nylon bushings on, you can go ahead and separate your grounds out. Do two steps in one. Okay, now that I've got all my grounds separated, I'm going to start forming them and working them up one by one. I'll take this half and work this way. I'll take this half and work this way. Take the extra time to straighten your wires. It's going to make it look so much neater in the end, and they're going to work with you so much better. So much easier to form them and work them. Keep everything looking nice and neat, man. You'd be surprised at how many journeymen don't do this. Now that I have my grounds, I'm starting to number and form my neutrals. Make sure and transfer each number. It makes your life easier. Make sure as you're forming each wire, you're taking your time and being proud of your work. There's nothing worse than opening a panel and seeing somebody that rushed through it or just wasn't prideful. Go the extra mile. People are watching. You're being noticed, I promise. Obviously, I didn't do it here, but I know there's no power. Always check with a hot stick or multimeter. Ensure everything is off. Safety is key. So it's preference here, but I like to start with my grounds, then I like to terminate all of my neutrals, and I like to do my hots to my breakers. Lastly, I found this makes it easier for me. You may find it easier another way, but this is my final product pretty much. I'm got a few more to terminate but this is my end result everything's clean everything's tight I'm proud of it my boss is proud of it and everybody that walks by and looks at it gives me a fist bump y'all go subscribe if you enjoy if this helps you out any thank you if you found any value go smash that subscribe button and check out some of my other content thank you